Hello everyone, my name is Mr. Tauchi and uh, welcome to the 2020-2021 school year. Uh, I'm looking really forward to uh, starting the, the new school year. We've got masks enforced and uh, it's going to be a really interesting year with uh, COVID-19. The last time that I produced one of these were, where we went around the, the departments where we are right now in the broadcasting center was 2018 and uh, we didn't have masks or anything like that. So um, it's gonna be quite a change this year, but we're gonna get through it. We're gonna come out stronger and uh, we're gonna be better. So um, just kind of take you on a little tour here. This is my office. And uh, if I'm nowhere to be found in the TV studio or the radio station or in 3303, this is where I will probably be. So. Um, it's right on the outside, inside of the, uh, the editing room. So that's where you can find me in my office. All right. That should just about do it. Hi kids, it's Mr. Mathis. I'm just showing you one of the many places you'll see me here at FHS. Welcome to the broadcasting department. Let's go see some other stuff. This is our video editing studio, and we've got 12 editing stations for all of our students to use. Mr. Mathis has a little bit more on this room. Hello again, Mr. Mathis here at one of our 12 edit suites, Premiere Pro. I'll be helping you out learn this program, as well as I edit some things for our district right on these computers. It's a great editing program. You're going to enjoy the heck out of it. Thanks, Mr. Mathis. So if you are a Video Production 2 student, you're going to be filming and editing in this room. Um, you'll be editing some features and some interviews and different things like that. Um, if you're video production one, our hope is that we'll be producing TV commercials and public service announcements and some uh, music videos, along with some other specialized videos for the, the school district. So uh, we're, we're using Adobe Premiere Pro in here on all 12 of our systems. It's a great program and we look forward to teaching it to you. Mr. Math is back here. Hey, we're in the live sports and events lab. It's actually a storage room for uh, a course offering, which is live sports and events. This is our portable production switcher. It's called a TriCaster. We can do all kinds of things. We've got the new logo up there. We can just bring it up over a piece of video. We have four camera capability. It's a super fun class. This is where we store everything. This is where we build our shows right on this. And then we take all of this to the site, whether it's the gym or the football field or the hockey arena. We'd love to have you there. This is our FHS radio station. And anyone who's interested in becoming a radio disc jockey or announcer, you can uh, check this lab out and uh, do a podcast. You can have uh, one other person in here with you, uh, social distancing, of course. And so we used to be able to have four people just standing right next to each other, but uh, because of COVID, we can't do that. But if you are interested in doing something like this, playing music, recording a podcast, if you know a lot about a subject and you want to get it out there, out to the web, I can help you with that. So just let me know. On the flip side of the radio station, we've got a recording studio that have, we have a couple keyboards in here, synthesizers, we've got a drum machine, we've got a garage band, and what we can do here is we can have students customize their own music for any of their projects. We don't want to go to YouTube or, or to any other website and just download a, a song for free or whatever or steal it. That's copyright infringement. So we're going to challenge all of our students this year to come in here and make your own music. Uh, it sets your creativity free. And it's a lot more fun too. So you have more ownership of your projects. Check one, two, three, four. Yep, we're matching frequencies. Hey, it's me again. I'm up here in the recital hall. This is one of my other jobs here. Performance facilities manager. Help run all the tech and lights and sound for a lot of the events right here in this giant recital hall. Here's our big audio board. Very similar to one of the ones that you'll use uh, for Tiger News. So that's just one of the many hats I wear here. The two rooms behind me are recording studios. Now students can go in and they can record voiceovers, they can record sound effects, whatever they need. They can also record music in there on GarageBand. 
Each room is set up identical to the other one. So once you know one room, you'll know the other one also. So if you need help uh, recording or doing anything in there, just let me know. This is our master control room for our live shows. Everything that's happening out in the studio, everything comes back into this room. As far as cameras one through six, all of our graphics, our uh, video playback is coming off of our Avid. So um, anytime that we have a live show, this is the heartbeat of that production. Uh, so what we're gonna be using this for uh, Tiger Live News this trimester, and we're going to have as few people in here as we can just to stay healthy. This is our audio control room. This is where all the microphones come into the board for a live show. And so all of our anchors can be heard while they're wearing a lapel microphone. And then we also record all of our shows on Final Cut Pro, which is right behind me. But uh, we have usually one person running all the sound for the shows. This is our brand new Tiger Live news set. Every single piece of paint that you see on all three panels or any word or anything on the desk, this was my summer project. Uh, we had orange, black, and white for the past 10 years. And given last year's COVID-19, everything, we were just, I was ready for a break and something new and something fresh. So. This is our new set for all of our shows for the coming years. One of the great things about this job is I get to employ a small staff of students, many of whom come from our tech classes that get to help me with the many events that we have typically here in the recital hall. Hey, thanks Mr. Mathis. Do you think we have enough tools here? This is our green screen in our studio. Uh, we use the green screen for uh, doing weather and we also use it for our special visual effects. We're also going to use it for digital stop-motion animation this trimester. So um, we've got jibs and we've got tripods and we've got everything that you could imagine. Uh, we're going to be using a lot of this for our Tiger News class and also for our movie production class as well. So that's a quick look at our broadcasting department, the TV studio, the recording studios, the radio station. Uh, the editing suite, all of this stuff is available to you anytime that you want to use it. You just have to come in and use it. So I look forward to this upcoming year and hey, you know what? Let's go make some stuff. <laughs>